Hey guys, Tay here and welcome to the return of the Call of Duty Ghost weapon guide that I've been doing, well, kind of doing months ago, but I had to push it to one side while we saw no new gameplay for Call of Duty Ghost and wait for the new gameplay to come out, which has come around at this Gamescom event and uh, the multiplayer reveal about a week ago as well. So I'm really glad to be back doing this. We have seen, excitingly, all four of the sniper rifles uh, which are going to be in Call of Duty Ghost revealed to us, so I'm going to be analysing them one by one. I've already done one, which was the L115, and I did that way back in episode 6. Seven, I think that was and so that weapon has been confirmed in multiplayer so there are three other sniper rifles that we've got to get through one of them I'm going to be doing in this episode and then in the next two I'm going to be doing the next two sniper rifles as well so what I'm going to do because we got some great feedback from this last time I did it and um, basically once this video gets to 100 likes I'll release the next episode of the weapons guide which will be covering the third sniper rifle in Call of Duty Ghost multiplayer so all we have to do is get that video to 100 likes and I'll release the video as soon as that happens otherwise I'll release it in like a couple of days time and just space out nicely over the next few days so anyway into the information that you came to this video about this weapon that we're covering in this episode is called the Lynx sniper and it was revealed at gamescom in a presentation that Mark Rubin did, they just flashed this image on screen revealing all four of the multiplayer snipers that would be in Call of Duty Ghosts. So this weapon was designed in Hungary by the manufacturer's Zero. Now it is about 112 centimeters long and weighs 11.5 kilograms. It's a semi-automatic weapon and the rate of fire is not actually very well documented and so I wasn't able to find out what this sniper's rate of fire is. And as a matter of fact, it does look like this sniper is pretty much unknown um, on the internet even and so to me that says that Infinity Ward have got a lot of creative license uh, to change and modify this sniper quite to their specific needs and standards to uh, fill the gaps that the other three snipers don't take up. However, the mag size of this weapon is five rounds and due to the specific design of the weapon it's been built to have really really low recoil that is one of the things that it actually champions that it has one of the lowest recoils of a sniper so if we're looking for something like special features that this gun might have it would definitely be that it has low recoil now this is an extremely powerful weapon and although it's not known for its amazing accuracy it will shoot up to 1600 meters which is plenty big enough I'm guessing for any Call of Duty map in Call of Duty Ghost so that's all that we know about the Lynx sniper and as I've said it is quite a shy animal so uh, we haven't seen much of it on the internet don't know really much about it at all it may give infinity ward a lot of creative license but we'll see about that later so thank you very much for watching guys if we get this video to 100 likes i'll release the next episode as soon as that happens thank you for watching and i'll see you all in a bit ciao